welcome ladies and gentlemen to another random free game that you guys can play right now This is called block explode and this is just a demo the game's not actually out yet But it is a free demo anyone can download it on steam right now And uh, it's basically about trying to strategically place explosives to blow up and topple block based towers which if you've been following my channel at all destroying things that people have built including things that i've built is just kind of what we do all right so from what i understand we have our explosives down here this level gives us one explosive we can rotate around the tower we can see how it's built where its structural you know weak points might be and then we have to blow it up and get as much of the tower as we can to fall below the water level. And this is our percentage right here. So if we get above 85%, then we pass the level. I kind of feel like in order to best do this, I need this thing to topple sideways. So I'm gonna place this bomb. Uh, oh, this is a big bomb. I don't know what the blast radius is on this, but here, oh no, I don't wanna place it right there. Can I move it after I placed it? Let's see. Ah, yes, I can. All right, because I want it to be like on the inside of this leg right there. All right, and then there's a detonate button. So let's press the detonate button and see if we succeed. Ah, ah. Hey, it wasn't 100%. 95%, I will take it though. That was interesting. I thought I was not going to succeed there for a second and then it finally lost the structural integrity. So, on to the next level. So, I think there are some levels. Oh, okay. Oh, there's different types of object. All right, so the, this one, what? This one, I guess we need 80% of the tower plus we need all four of these guys in here, I think. I'm going to put this uh, over here because my idea right now is I'm going to blast these blocks out of the way. This corner will become destabilized and hopefully flip down and drop these four blocks. Let's see what happens. That was a lot more destructive than I thought it was going to be. I really got to get used to the blast radius on this stuff. All right, 89%. I'll take it. Next level. Oh, we got dummies. Hey, this reminds me of the main assembly dummies. Oh, whoa. Whoa, what? There's the wrecking ball here. What does the wrecking ball do? I don't know what this level is all about. I'm just going to place an explosive right there and see what happens. Oh, okay. There they go. I don't know what it's measuring on this level. Oh, it is measuring these too. Oh, that was close. Okay, so I think the blue blocks have to be in the water plus whatever percentage of the rest of the blocks also have to be in the water. All right, I'm learning, I'm learning. Ooh, now I kind of choose a path, don't I? Interesting. Hmm, so you could technically like miss some levels. Each of the structures can be made of different materials, metal, rubber, and plastic. Okay. Metal blocks are much heavier and harder to blow up. Mmm. Plastic blocks are much easier. Mmm. Things are getting more and more complex. All right, this one actually does seem kind of difficult. Um, I need to get. I feel like I need to get the bottom just out of there. So let's just put it on the bottom. That did not. It, no, that did not work very well. All right, I feel like this is a weaker point right here. We need to get these blue blocks into the water. Man, that is, that is not, oh, oh, there we go, there we go, there we go. That was, this is harder than I thought it was going to be. All right, they're all in the water. Ugh. Oh, that was close. These look, this is actually kind of already getting more difficult than I expected it to get. This is interesting. All right, let's continue along up this path. So I'm going to go to the left path. You guys can go to the right path if you download this game and you'll probably get different levels than I, than you even saw in this video. All right, so for this, I feel like we need to get rid of a lot of these pillars. Oh, I can't fit the bomb in there. Hmm, I really wanted to just get the bomb like in. No, I'm gonna go for right here though anyway. I think not all of these are... What? Is this all metal? What? Oh, I'm stupid. I think I see what I need to do. Oh, I have two bombs. I didn't realize I had two bombs. I could place two bombs on this level. Okay, in that case, I'm gonna get one leg 
And then I'm gonna get the other leg. Just like that. And they should also, uh... Oh! They go one at a time. I didn't know that. I thought they would all explode at the same time, and that did nothing. That did absolutely nothing. What's going on here? I know I failed. I know I failed. Restart the level. All right, so it does seem like uh, we probably need to get rid of the pillars like I was originally going to do. So here, I'm gonna move them like this and hopefully two bombs will be enough to move them. All right, well, here, let's experiment up here. Let's see how heavy are these. Are these gonna be able to get moved by one explosive? No, but that, what? I only used one bomb. No, go, 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 go! Okay, that's what we gotta do. Apparently, this is the spot right here. So here, let's just do that and do that and hope that this does it faster. Yeah! Come on, come on. There we are. All right, all right, I'm learning, I'm learning. I'm learning how physics works. I've only been playing physics sandbox games for four years on my channel. It's about time I learned how that stuff works. Ooh, ooh, I know what I'm doing. Oh, whoa, ooh. I feel like right here, if this stuff isn't metal, this should be it. All right, this stuff is just not having the impact that I expect it to have, all right? All right, well, I feel like we need to go up higher then and knock these pillars out. Let's see if this does it. I just like, oh, what? The pillars didn't even move. These pillars didn't move. What? <laughs> Apparently, I haven't learned how physics works in this game yet. All right, out of curiosity though, like the whole thing kind of bent at the middle. So what if I actually just give it direct force from the middle here? Will it like... Oh, that almost worked exactly how I wanted it to work. It just wasn't quite enough force. Maybe if I give it a torque as well, if I do it not centered, but on the side, then it'll kind of spin and uh, bend. No. All right, so given my experience with the bomb so far, I'm gonna put it on the inside, like right here. And I'm hoping that the blast wave is gonna remove one of these blocks over here. And then that whole top section comes toppling down. That almost worked. Look how close that is. That actually almost worked. Oh, I know what to do now. I know what to do. All right, I need to place it top center right there. There we go. There we go. Yes, that was it. <laughs> Look at that, 95%. I wonder if I can 100% one. Oh, okay. You know what's gonna happen is those are just gonna be super heavy and it's gonna make it really hard to move any of these pillars, isn't it? But if I were to do this, I'd probably put it in the middle right there and hope that these outside pillars also get moved out. Ooh. Ooh, I know what to do. I wanna put it in the middle, but facing these three pillars. And then hopefully these three will kind of move out from the side. Oh, so close. So close. Hmm, hmm, what happens if I do this? I'm hoping that this will kind of twist this whole beam out from the side. Not exactly what I thought, but putting it on the corner gave it just enough torque that it was able to counter spin itself down. That was cool. All right, so up next is, um, this is a lot. We have one bomb to work with for all of this. I feel like if I put it right here, it might have a chance to blast all four of these out, but I think... Oh, I didn't realize that they were split into two separate pieces. All right, so if I was to do this, I think I need to focus it on one of these corners here. Yep, I know what I'm doing. I know exactly what I'm doing. 92%, all right, let's go. Whoa, oh, we have four bombs on this? Okay, and there's a lot. There's a lot of those blue blocks. And this is like, this is a, this is a really, really strong tower. All right, what if I just line them all up on this side here? Oh, it numbers them so you know what order they're gonna explode in too. 
Yeah, tip over. Uh oh, I think I did it. I think they're all in the water. Is enough of this in the water though? Oh, two oh, percent. Oh, we barely passed that one. All right, we're getting close to the key here. I forget what I forget what it said the keys do. Oh. You must keep it out of the water. You will fail the level. Oh, things are getting more in. I need to get 70% of this stuff in the water. Plus this guy. I have five bombs to work with. 70% of this stuff plus this blue block and not that green block. What? All right. I definitely got to do some experiments here. Oh my god. All right. I think I see. I see. I see. I see. I see. We need to get the diamond, the crystal to roll down into a safe space and then we can deal with the rest of it. Can I put a bomb on the crystal? No, I can't. I can put it right there though. That's kind of close enough. All right, but I have a problem. And the problem is the other bombs explode at a fixed time, as far as I know. So I have to make sure that all those other bombs are not gonna beat the crystal down and destroy the crystal. All right, but let's try this. So block number one goes there. Or bomb number one goes there. Bomb number two, I'm gonna put right there. Uh, then number three, I guess I'm gonna go like here, here, and here. This is this is gonna be like an action movie right now. All right, here we go. Go, 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 Crystal, go! Oh no, it went in the water. That was so close. I don't know if that would have worked. All right, come on, Crystal, you can do it. Yeah, get down there. Yeah, it worked that time. Now, will these walls actually fall over like I hope? Crystal? Crystal, why are you doing this to me? All right, come on, this is the one. All right, it's going, it's going. Stay steady, Crystal, stay steady. Do not fall down. Come on, more, more! I want more! I don't know if this is it. I do not know if this is it. I got it perfectly on the line. We needed 70%. I got 70%. We got this. All right. Oh, no. The demo ends right before the key. Oh, I can go this way. I can go. I can do all these if I wanted to as well. Here, I just want to where's this middle one? Why would you do? Oh, I guess you can get that key from the middle. All right, let's just do this middle one. Oh, two crystals. Man, these are hard. And I go, that guy, what? Well, these are already like in the water. Two bombs? Okay. Oh, oh, okay. I wanna do an experiment here. This is balanced. So presumably if I was to knock anything off from this side, it should tilt to the other side. But no, it's kind of like, that's what I thought was gonna, yeah, I, I figured that that would be what happens instead. So if we place a bomb right here, that should kick everything over and these crystals hopefully will fall down onto that. See, that's what I, okay, all right. You know, you're messing with me now, game. You're messing with me now. <laughs> we put that there, and I guess we just gotta get this guy off here, so let's just put that right there. All right, let's see it. There they go. How? How? How is this possible? How are they supposed to not tumble off that? We got, is this like a luck challenge? I'm going for a Hail Mary here. We're just gonna jolt this a little bit. It's not gonna really tip it over right away, but I think it should head back to the other side. Look at that, just like that. Like I couldn't ask for a more perfect result. Oh, oh! They just have to not be in the water. If they fall off the whole platform, that's just as good. Okay, there we go. Right, I'm sorry, I gotta do one more. This is addicting. I gotta do at least one more. Maybe two more. Whoa, what is this? I know what to do. I don't know what to do. I know what to do. I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna hope that this middle pillar doesn't move because I'm just having a downwards force and that the shockwave gets all those. The middle, middle pillar moved. Middle pillar definitely moved. And the shockwave did nothing. None of what I wanted to happen happened there. Okay, so really, I got two bombs. I got, I, we need dominoes. We need a domino effect to happen here. So if I do this, and 
I don't know this. I don't know. That wasn't quite a domino effect, was it? Here, I'm gonna put one right there. And I'm gonna put one right here. And now, this guy should knock into this into that. This guy should knock into this into that. And then same thing from this corner. I, that's my theory, at least. Let's test it. Oh, look at that. That wasn't exactly what I saw happening, but like 95% of the way there. Wow. That was a satisfying one. All right, the demo's blocking us from progressing any higher up the level tower, and I could do these levels I haven't done yet, but you know what? I'm gonna save those uh, so you guys can play them spoiler-free. You won't know what the levels are. I don't know what the levels are, so you can have some fresh levels after watching this video. I'll leave a link down in the description if you want to try out the game yourself. Hope you guys enjoyed this random game video. If you missed last week's random game video, um, you're not gonna want to check that out, but here it is on the end screen anyway, in case you want to haunt your, haunt your dreams for the next month. Anyway, I hope this video has earned your subscription. This has been Scrap Man, and I'll see you next time. Bye.